Hello everyone, welcome to the first episode of Nino Kuni 2 Revenant Kingdom. I'm gonna set the difficulty to normal. Now let's start. Once upon a time, there were two worlds. One was a world torn by endless war, where strong lands devoured weak, and peace was a distant dream. And the other was Mr. Drippy's world. Only a few great realms remained, Kidding. glaring at each other across brittle borders. But then came a great king, one who would change this world forever. Hmm. Seems like their world evolved into ours, right? Apparently even as a, an United States. We'll be arriving shortly, Mr. President. Hmm. What in the world? Well, that's a missile, Mr. President. And it goes kaboom boom. Oh, that's a nuclear warhead, I'd forgotten. Chapter 1. The Fall of the House of Tildrum. Hmm. Remember Tildrum? I did tell you to keep those things in mind. My lord, the preparations are complete. Excellent. Then let us begin. <laughs> now look at that. Mice soldiers. Which, again, I told you to keep in mind. Specifically the mice. Someone somehow cast Gateway without even realizing it, I'm guessing. Uh, what? What happened? So, which one d uh, do you think you're gonna play as? King of Ding Dong Dell! Who are you? Never mind who. The question is where? No, the question is who. You just invaded oh. the room, the bedroom of a king. Well, now. Would you look at that? <laughs> Stay where you are! <laughs> yeah, that is the descendant of King Tom. In case you couldn't tell. So yeah, you play as the President of the United States of America in the Nino Kuni game. I could not make this up if I wanted to. Hmm. I'll just say that again. You play as the President of the United States of America in a Nino Kuni game. <sighs> Excuse me. <laughs> yeah, Roland, you are seriously disrespecting what? a king. What? You are not dead, but this is in the middle of a coup. Hmm. I yeah, just ask the king to be a good hey! boy. Now, if um, mm. if this alone, the fact that you're playing as the president of the United States of America in an Inokuni game, doesn't tell you that this one is completely different from the first one and just freaking insane, 
I don't know what will. Ah, finally, camera reset on the right stick. Yeah, the guards are not with you anymore, your majesty. Pistol. That noise. In there. That'll teach me to get trigger happy. They're not here to protect you. Get back. Because, you know, every president keeps a gun. Because that's a normal thing to do. Oh, and of course, <clears throat> the guy knows how to use a sword. Because, again, that's normal. So yeah, the combat is also completely different, no more familiars, which actually makes me sad, just for the record. You also don't need to unlock jumping, but yeah. No more familiars, which actually makes me, makes me uh, a bit sad, but on the other hand, the combat is like this. What? Hey. How does he even know what a coup is? Did friends come to be in the, in the hey. Nino Kuni world? But, but... I mean, it's not like uh, the word is English, you know? It's a French word. It's a loan word. To strike! While our enemy was preoccupied with preparations for the ceremony. This was a very clever strategy indeed, my lord. Uh -huh. If only King Leonard had been less robust. He would have succumbed to the poison all the sooner, and our plot would have come to fruition all the more quickly. <laughs> yeah, the mice are overthrowing what does it matter the cats. Now? Did we not plan Although this guy's a weasel. Stubbornness on his part? King Leonard's untimely demise was affected without a hitch. Now the only obstacle remaining is the boy. The boy. Bring the boy. Yes, my lord. And once he is eliminated, the throne will be ours for the taking. It is time for mouse kind to assume its rightful place at last. <laughs> Mousinger, who for some reason looks like a weasel, as Lord I said. Mousinger, the boy, he... he's escaped! And you're about to be what? executed. No matter. We will find him soon enough. Or rather, the Black Knight will. If you want to be mysterious and uh, consider terrifying, you have to do two things. Number one, be really, really good at what you do. No. Number two, never speak. Or, you know, show any emotion or anything. Unless your face is covered, because then you can kind of smile to hey. yourself and giggle silently. You know, just make the expression, but without actually making any noise. Mm-hmm. All right. Still waters run deep. So, who are they gonna say nuked America? Wait, what? Oh yeah, right, you also open with a bunch of dead bodies. I mean, the first one... Uh, just opened up... Okay. Uh, the first one opened up, of course, with um, Oliver's mom's death, which was very sad. This one opens with a full-blown coup and also nuclear attack on the United States. And again, this is a game for children. I just want to emphasize that. 
Oh right, this is just a uh, soft lock on, I think. Stop right there! You! How can I fire? Oh, that's How can I use the gun? Wait, did he just teleport? <laughs> I'd forgotten he could do that. It's kinda creepy when characters teleport to you in my opinion. Nella um, is basically a servant, huh. a top servant. Different approach. Can you guess what that is? That's right, it's time for stealth. As I said, this game is just completely different. That was my fault, I didn't pay attention. Last sh yeah, last save should be here. That's what I was gonna say. Sir. Should still be able to sneak past. Yeah. Hey. They have the typical video game enemy line of sight, meaning directly in front and no further. Can you move a bit, Evan? Thank you. Evan Pettywhisker Tildrum. Why is he why are they even patrolling this area? Come on. Famous last words. What was that noise? Hmm. Must be my imagination. Famous last henchman words. Uh, sorry, famous last words. Fam famous henchman last words. Check upstairs, there might be a chest. There is no chest. In case you couldn't tell, the locations here are much, much bigger. Just look at this. This would be an entire dungeon in Ninokuni 1. Here it's just. Um, just a single building. <sighs> Trapped. Ah, finally. Stop right there. <laughs> now, sorceress. You. So the president of the United States just leveled up. Wait, escape or, or destroy them? Oh, 
Uh, those two are not the same. Fireball. The most basic of spells. I gotta say, I really like the design of skeleton so enemies in, in this game. They're not just, you know, ske holy shit, that's Nella. That's just so you know, Evan Sorry, was not kidding. As quickly as I could. She is a badass. Nella! Evan! Mm. I don't know why the subtitle said Aranella, which is her full name, when he just said Nella. Mm. Yes, mm -hmm. Roland. Finally! Wait, what? Oh, I have to... Okay, I thought I could hold, and then... No. Alright. So, as I was saying, I really like the design of the skeletons, you know, with the jelly. Thank you. Governess, that's the job description. Yes. What? Of course, the Chancellor, yeah. Well, obviously, it's always the advisor. No. But, but. Yes. If you're a king, here's a tip. Never trust your advisors. If video games have taught me anything... Mm, nope. Uh, it's that it'll only end badly. Or, or rather, you can trust their advice, but always keep in the back of your mind the notion that they're gonna betray you at some point. Throw, um, stage a coup. And kill you. Huh. Yeah. There is a way out. Soar away. You can probably guess what that is, right? Thanks. No. When the other one broke, it had a green orb. Hey, thankfully there's no friendly fire, otherwise I would have been in trouble. Okay then. There we go. Soar away used. A chest which cannot be opened. Oh, there are also a lot more characters, and I don't mean, like, uh, regular, or rather, generic NPCs that just say one or two things. I am talking, like, dozens of characters. Hell, actually, I think there's over a hundred characters with actual um, motivations and crap. I'm not, e I'm not even sure of the, the correct number at this point, but Excuse trust me, me, this game is so much bigger in scope than the first one that it's going to make the first one look like it was a demo. And, you know, I've said it often, I'll say it again, I love the first game, but this one is going to make, in terms of the scope of the game, uh, it's just going to make the first one look like a short demo. Ah, Waystone. Why the hell did I use the Soraway then? Who 
What was that name? Shh. Dude, that was the shut up. Night. Hmm. Forbidden magic. Oh. Yeah, uh, Nella cannot beat the the Black Knight. No, the guy who obtained great power by forbidden magic. Huh? Yeah, you are dressed in a suit from our world, dude. Much better. Say. Sassy. That's how you look. Oh! <laughs> what is it? Wow. Now. Sword, thank you. Uh, mm -hmm. So they understand the concept of any ammunition. Yes, yeah, see, you can switch weapons. I mean, look at this. How incredible is it? I mean, again, this is basic stuff for for games nowadays, but I'm comparing it to the the, uh, the first Nino Kuni game. Well, obviously the. The broadsword, not the rat slicer. Oh, what the hell am I doing? Right. I also don't know why I expected. Ah, oh, fine. Why the hell would I even bother with that, though? Left trigger. Zing gauge. Zing. <laughs> well, obviously, I want the automatic or the, the manual. Sorry. What is with my brain today? Waystones. All for the amazing price of absolutely nothing. It's like healthcare in a developed world. Although we do pay, pay taxes for those. But I'd rather pay those taxes. Much better than having to... to pay for crap by, uh, by myself or forcing others to do it because I could most likely afford to pay stuff Thanks. Uh, for myself but others couldn't many others couldn't and Gosh. Um, you know I, I think helping others is a good thing Evan. that seems like a controversial opinion nowadays mm. But it's also just right. logical. Everybody pay, uh, pays less in the end, if we all chip in a bit. I just think that makes a little sense. Sneak? No. We're fighting! No, we're sneaking. Move faster. Oh, he just teleported.
I just want to comment on the fact that Evan is just absolutely adorable. Look at that cute little face. <clears throat> you just want to pinch his cheek. And then have him bite you because he's a cat and he probably won't like that. Although my boyfriend's cat does like that. You've probably been wondering what those things in the corner are. Well, you'll see. There is one thing that I will say about this game that I... I'm not saying don't like, uh, but preferred in the first game. There is no wizard's companion or no. equivalent that I recall. And that thing was just a marvel. Yes. It was an amazing piece of detail that explained everything about the world. It took great care to make it, and it's honestly one of my favorite things in Nino Kuni. Oh. Or rather, one one of the thing, uh, one of my favorite things that shows to to show how much work went into mm. the game. I mean, it's like if uh, the, Harry po <clears throat> the Harry Potter books had been written for the games, if the games were good. What? Because I remember, like, one game where you actually do some school stuff, the last one is just an FPS, or a third-person shooter, rather, uh, with, with nice effects. Hmm. I mean, sure, you cast spells and crap, but it's, it's a third-person shooter. You don't actually experience Hogwarts or any of that crap, so, or, or, crap, or at least not much. And that is honestly depressing. Hopefully the new Harry Potter game will fix all that. And actually be good. Look at that. Ding dong well. Remember this place? I remember it well. That was not supposed to be a joke. Or a pun, rather. Dollop of crude sap. Oh yeah, they also upped the crafting in this game. This, will be over soon. this is also a very neat way that they they created to, uh, regarding battles. Battles are fluid, not like in the, uh, the original or the first game, rather. <coughs> where you encountered an enemy then you just kinda had to watch a, a cutscene and so on. Here it is completely fluid. Huh? Flatliner. What the? And look at this, also one of my favorite features. Will gradually the MP gauge will gradually refill as you attack enemies. Well now. And I love MP gauges that refill. It can be by by themselves or uh, by having me do something, but I, I love it, and I would not have it any other way. Unfortunately, here they went with the let's allow 32 save files, which is a lot, granted. But in the original, I could just create new ones whenever. Sorry, I keep saying the original, the first game. The original, uh, I don't even know how many save slots I actually had, because uh, the first game that, uh, that I played is, is technically a remake of the original Nino Kuni. Anyway, um, 
what I've seen so far is only the tip of the tip of the iceberg, because believe me, this game goes above and beyond in just about every respect, and it is just an incredible work of art. <clears throat> uh, but that is it for today, unfortunately. I do need to get some, uh, some food. So, as always, thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed, and I will see you again next time.